Hey, my name's Mark. I'm a new indie game developer working on a game called Button Pop. It's a mashup between an idol, a tower defense, and a button masher game where you are the main button and you have to defend yourself against all the other evil little jealous buttons coming to get you. I really wanted to show you guys where the game is at the moment and, you know, let you guys see a little bit behind the scenes sort of stuff. But really importantly to me, I really want to get your guys' feedback on it and see what you guys think. So yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so I've actually only been working on the game for about four or five weeks so far, but I've actually made some really good headway in development. Um, at the moment, I've got six enemy types. The mini clicker, the regular clicker, the spawner, the boss, the gunner, and the exploder. All of which will work together to take out your defenses like the turrets and walls, uh, or even just take you out altogether. Another thing I've been working on recently is my level design. Uh, I've got about 7 or 8 maps out of a plan 10 so far, and they range from green meadows, desert sand, lava pits, and asteroid belts. So quite a wide variety of biomes, and you know, I, I just <laughs> I hope people enjoy them. Another big feature I've been working on recently is the pick a button section. Uh, this is kind of the customization for the game where you can select from a variety of different types of buttons and switches and triggers uh, as your sort of character uh, which will all have their own animations and effects that come along with it i've also added in the feature so you can select from different colors like primary secondary and even the the texture that's on the um the button itself um i've also added in the ability to add hats um so at the moment there's only a handful, but I'll add as many models as I can. And you can also select the color for the, the hat as well. You can also change the visual effects of the button. As standard, it's a little coin that pops out, but you can change it to the likes of confetti or fireworks. Uh, but I do want to add a lot of variety to this. So, you know, if you guys have any ideas, like cool ideas, then drop a comment down below and I'll add it in. So yeah, thanks for watching this week's devlog. Uh, plan on making one every week until the game is released and yeah really just look forward to your guys feedback on the game and the channel um so yeah i guess see you guys later bye